Another feature of the Genie Vision 6100 is the ability to be able to project something from the visualizer and then use an interactive response system to gauge an audience opinion about what they're actually looking at up on the screen. So sort of like voting. Yes, exactly. Really? Yes, yes. So what I have here is some questions which could be some past exam papers, for instance, that I'm doing with my class. And if I place the exam paper on the visualizer, that's then displayed upon the screen so that all of my class can see it. And then what I'm going to do is give you a response system handset here. And then we're going to ask a question, ask you to answer the question that you're seeing up on the screen there. Now, how does basically that get onto your laptop and then on? Is, is, is it a special kit? Is it a special package? It's a piece of software called VideoCap, and that is supplied with the visualizer. So that comes as part of the package, the VideoCap software. It's all with it. So and very easy. Again, one click. Yeah on click and it's open and you get the live feed coming through. Right, and then yeah. we use these. And then we're going to use these. So what we're going to do is we're going to open up Census, which is a voting tool, and we're going to say, right, we can see the question underneath, which is coming from the visualizer, and we're going to ask a spontaneous question, which is going to be a true or false question. Then we're going to click Done, and we're going to say Start Responding. So we've read the question, you understand what the question's about, and then in a moment when the toolbar appears at the bottom, we're going to ask you to respond to that question. So here comes the toolbar, and then if you switch your handset on by pressing the on button at the bottom there, and then press either true or false, you'll see your response is being picked up at the bottom of the screen there. Oh, now, yeah. What I can now do, when everybody has responded, so I've got everybody in my class involved in what's going on, everybody's had to give me a response, nobody's been able to opt out, and then I want to see what responses you've given me, so I click on the graph button and I can now see that two people thought the answer was true and one person thought the answer was false. And again, this is all in the package that comes with this system. With the, with the visualizer, yeah. And I can see that in this format and I can see that in that format as again, well. Again, great for different ages because visually yeah. Yeah. something in one, one band might appeal to younger children and as you say, as it gets a bit older and a bit more developed, yeah, some of the that's other... Right. Formats. And then when I've finished, I can simply close that down and stop responding from there. And then that takes that away, minimise that down, and then I can change the question underneath on the visualiser. Wow, that's very, very useful.